All right, hello everyone. This is Osmond and Call Me Frost, or just Frost, and we are here for the um, still week one. This is the last match of the week. It's going to be against. Um, I'm I'm told it's pronounced B -b -b Clappers, Clappers. I don't. I think I'm just going to call it Clappers. It's just going to be Clappers versus <laughs> Hard Stuck. Um, so. Clappers versus Hardstuck. We're going to have uh, Clappers on the blue team and Hardstuck on the red team today. And it's going to be an epic showdown between these uh, two very powerful Overwatch League level teams that uh, have decided to graciously join us down here in LFGS just to see what the plat brackets are all about. So what do you think about tonight's match, Frost? I honestly haven't heard of either of the teams, and I haven't seen any of their gameplay, but I'm looking forward to watching it. Th those are the best games when you know oh, yeah. nothing about anything. Definitely. You love you and love the ones where you, have, you know nothing. You just go in blind, like, who are these teams? Exactly. And we're starting out on Oasis, too. So I think so far all the games, most mm. of the games have started out with Lijong. No, there was one team, I think, that they started out with Oasis. By the way, um... I'm excited. I think they all started legit. I I think because it comes into map five sometimes, and they they'll sometimes go with uh, oh okay oasis. Okay. I think we have seen a map five oasis, but I don't I don't know about the map okay. one oasis. So it normally is that Lijong. Mm -hmm. Everyone loves it. Yeah, indeed. So yeah, I think uh, teams look like are they ready to go? Yes, they are. Yeah. All right. Sounds good. So um, I'm just hoping I don't get the applying update glitch. Uh, oh we no! Hope. Don't I'm jinx seeing it. applying update. Knock on wood. Knock Enter on game. wood. No, no. no. Oh, here we go. What? Oh my no. god! No glitches here. No glitches okay. to be seen today. This is extremely good news. That is exactly what I want to see. Um, okay. No glitches. No glitches. Definitely be preferred. Definitely be preferred. Okay, I'm gonna get a look at some team, uh, some some player names here. First off, I'm automatically no noticing Tiny Donut, which is probably the coolest name in the lot. <laughs> Slim Jim Joe, also really good name. <laughs> that reminds Dang. me of one of my teammates' names. Hey, Bork Bork, Schwain, Big Time. Dude, that, okay. okay. I love That's how we have Slim good. Jim, Big Time, Tiny. Uh, all these names have a cute little adjective. Kind of, kind of nice, kind of nice. And then we have uh, Cash Belly, kind of like Fancy. Cash Money. Fancy, uh, yes. Classy man. Crew, JoJo DeBoss. <laughs> Contagious and super solo, solo one, two, three. Five, okay, super all right. It is. We got clappers in blue, hard stuck on red. We're gonna see which team gets to the point first. Um, uh, they both run in Lucio. One's a dive, one's a brawl. I'm definitely interested to see how this goes. Absolutely. Dive, hard stuck going for the high ground. We got the brawl coming in from clappers. Let's see what prevails. They're both playing on the high ground. Ooh, big time gets the first kill on Contagious. That's a big kill. Ooh, no supports from the Clappers. Okay, hard stuck reclaiming the high ground. I think uh, is Clappers blue? Or is uh, Clappers no, is blue? no, no, no. Yeah, Clappers is blue. Oh, hard Clappers is, is blue. Right. Whoops, my bad guys, reverse that. <laughs> reverse, reverse. <laughs> reverse with no card. You know, I did that a lot last uh, future match. <laughs> I've been screwing that up. So so, so far, okay. uh, pretty clean stuff here. Um, we've seen from uh, the Clappers. Their dive Clappers pretty be on point. clapping on Indeed. the jumps. Schwain, they not, not, uh, not too afraid to jump straight into a Ryan Korn. I really like that, because he kind of has to against this team. Oh, he's just bypassing Ryan fully on the high ground. Oh he's no, Contagious, Can Contagious survives. Let's go, ride the wall. <laughs> But Dive is definitely taking advantage of this brawl. Looks like the brawl is just going to have to play tighter together or maybe make a switch up. Perhaps. But this I, dive think, uh, is... I think you're going to have to put more pressure on um, the people that are like diving into your team. Maybe even like beta dive. Because it seems to me like right now hard stuck. Uh, it seems to be maybe like running right into these kill zones, right into these kill boxes when mm -hmm. they could maybe bait the dive and then play something a little bit more defensive. Let's see if mm -hmm. they can adapt here. I definitely believe the comp is is very manageable against a dive. See this earth shatter from Cash Money okay. over here, though. Dive looks like any any earth shatter. We're gonna see it come down. We're gonna see it. Almost took out that tracer there. 
They might save it for next fight. I wouldn't be surprised. Old economy. Hood. Indeed, this does look like it's already gone far into the favor of oh, Clappers. 75% yes. on the clock here. Um, Clappers up in ult economy as well with four ults on the table. Hard stuck. Looking um, a little bit hard stuck on this map, unfortunately. They're going to have Shatter. They're coming up on Rush here. They're going to have to play for Rush, I think, if they're going to take this. So let's see how they do this. Um, let's see if maybe even uh, Jojo DeBoss is able to get a overclap before this fight's over. Watching uh, Jojo here getting kind of bumped around a little bit there. Not quite fast enough. But now uh, Super Sulo also just at 99% dies. Tiny Donut um, coming in with the 3k as a Genji. Indeed. That was pretty nice. Here comes the Shatter. Tiny Donut Got is jumping Luzu over the Earth Shatter. Comes out. Oh my. Well, okay. What we're seeing though is that uh, we're getting a lot of sustain on point from Hardstuck, and this fight's not actually over. Uh, Kitsune Rush here could actually turn this around. It's going to have to be a combo. Kitsune Rush with Classy I do have room. the ults. Oh, no. There's no one. It's still, okay, it's still sustainable here. I mean, like, until they get rid of Super Sulo, this isn't over. Now now, now um, Hardstuck, Kiriko, is taking a lot of pressure here. Contagious is the only support left on point for Hardstuck. Um, that's going to be Wraith Form out, out of the gate there for Classy. And I don't know if he's going to be able to stay up much longer. Although he is getting some Lucio heals. There's the dive pressure. And now... Cash money back on the table. Yeah. Finds a kill. This is really, really campy here from Cardstuck. They're not letting this one go. They are holding this out yes. as long as they possibly can. The stall is real. The Super stall Sumo's is back real, here. guys. I don't think... No, yeah. So not going to be able to touch. But good. I mean, like, that was a good attempt to, like, retake the point and stalling that out. The overtime lasted for, like, quite a while. I want to say, for like, sure. 30 seconds to a minute overtime. For sure. I definitely do believe Hardstuck was going to have to switch up their battle strategy if they're going to stick with the brawl. Uh, yes, it is customary to run a brawl on control, but on a map like Oasis, dive really does shine. It's, I agree. Uh, I, I do think between the three maps we have offered in our map pool, all of them do have potential for dive comps, and it just looks like Clappers is going to exploit that until they're told otherwise. Absolutely. Hardstuck, and... Yes, Hardstuck does have pressure. I just think they're going to have to play closer together, more like penguins, you know? Yeah, Protect and the this map has even better geometry for dive. So, like, dive, oh, yes. it looks like, is even better here, except it's really weird to see actually clappers going onto the coast side there and not just immediately taking all this high ground. This is what I'm expecting. This is exactly this makes what I'm expecting. Now, this makes sense, right. So now we're defending this high ground, and, and there's going to be some contesting point here. Point's not quite unlocked, but it looks like Clappers is going to elect to take the dive down into the stairwell. Not oh, quite what you wanted to do. I they actually baited just, out the dive just, there. Yes, playing patient, letting the dive come to them. I love it. Yes, I love this quick spin around of thought process. Understanding, let them come to you. Don't push out until you absolutely need to, and then you just kill whoever feeds. Exactly, and they actually played super defensively there. They played that well. It's the first team fight yes. that Hardstuck has won so far, and it's not going to be the last. So I'm expecting to see even more coming from Hardstuck here. Swain jumping all the way onto point here. They've got they've got Hardstuck kind of surrounded. Here, Hardstuck being down one is not kind of what you want to see. As Tiny Donut is okay. Well, I thought he was going to go like in for the kill. Now, looks okay. like they're even. It is more even now. It is a little bit more even. Scrappy as this is. Swain's really struggling to look for an angle to get away from the Rhine. He's not able to capitalize on a kill yet. I would say that's a really good thing from Cachavelli. He's playing in positions that's preventing their enemy tank to just take advantage of his backline. It really sounds like they picked, they they talked about it, and he's reflecting. We got Super over here supporting our Rhine, Cachavelli. Hardstuck really defending this point. They want as much percentage as they can get. Trying to build up there. I mean, they're 65% now. It's pretty interesting. This is the map that I actually thought would be more in favor of dive, but Hardstuck truly like sticking it to the stats and saying, "Nah, we're gonna run brawl, and you're gonna you're gonna hate us." <laughs> Let's see if we see any switches, but probably not due to Clappers having. 
almost five volts. Definitely three. They're definitely gonna have to give up. Mm, probably, probably primal. Probably see a pulse. A missed pulse bomb there from Big Time. Didn't quite find what they wanted. Here's a shatter and a brush um, coming down. And now, the, now the teams are being pulled all the way over to point here. And uh, clappers getting the picks they need. Although here's a here's a beat in response, but it was beat with two down. I'm not sure if they're going to be able to stay up here. Although now it is also three v three still. The blade comes out. The oh, blade kills two. Blade's gonna clean Tiny up. donut the going to clean gonna it help up. Clean. Yep. They just really wanted to secure that point so they could get a full reset. A look at the ults. That's Ooh. five ults. Five ults from uh, clappers there to be able to take that back. Heartstuck's yeah, coming stuff. up on uh, Kiriko ult, so they're probably going to use that. I would definitely recommend they use it. Definitely. Because it's the only ult on the field. It's a win condition. I think they should go high ground here, though. I think they should actually take uh, the high ground. Who's cl uh, Maybe. Oh. Classy Root contesting point there for a second. Tiny Donut just gets a kill onto jo uh, Jojo the boss, and that's one down here Ooh. for Hardstuck. I'm not sure how you're going to approach this. And it looks like Reaper from uh, Hardstuck. Getting a, getting a little bit pretty far forward there, almost like Reaper is the main tank here. <laughs> it does look like that Schwain just jumping in the middle of the team. And Classy cannot find him. Schwain is kind of just hopping around, isn't he? He's kind of just doing some stuff. Yes, he's just jumping. If he gets a kill, he gets a kill, and gets out. He's just partying, right? He's just like, <laughs> he just jumps wherever he wants. Just chilling. Okay, looks like we're gonna see a regroup. We're gonna see a regroup. Okay, hard stuck. Fully regrouping. Oh, let's see what Big Time wants to do. He has pulse. Is he gonna? Is he gonna stick it? Is he gonna stick it, guys? Let's, let's Come on. watch his perspective. Let's see. I believe, uh... I believe he's gonna stick it. He's gonna stick it. Okay, oh. okay. Close. Uh, very close. Next time, Big Time. Next time. Next time we'll okay. get it. Okay. Okay. Even, even support for support. Ooh, now it comes down fine. And we're gonna pick and then he dies! Hard stuff! Turn in the fight around! It is 99 to 99. Classaroo getting nice. a 2k here too. Almost a yeah. 3. Uh oh. Looking I see you. I see you, Slim nine, 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 nine. hiding up here. You're gonna touch last second, aren't you? Yep, yep, she is. And the Sir George <laughs> Jojo is looking at the Tracer. Look at the stall here. The Tracer is just in a great spot. Slim Jim. Slim Jim getting away with murder out here, guys. Literally getting murder. S is hiding. I love it. Okay, There's okay. We see a pin from Cachavelli. It. I can't tell if it connected, but here comes the primal. I think it did connect. This is a 99. All all ults out on the table. Use them as you get them, boys. Oh, classy crew's gonna come back oh my with God, ult. Time. If he gets back, if they're able to contest, they do have Reaper ult. Oh wow, Clapper's really turned it around. Let's see what Yay. Classy. Oh, Classy can't even touch, man. First map, it was definitely dive driven from Clapper's. So wait, kudos and great job on that. But I have to give it to Hardstuck that second map. They yeah, stuck with Brawl. Is said Hardstuck one? Uh, Hardstuck. Wait, so Hardstuck is blue? You know, we're gonna look at this. Show lobby. Hardstuck's blue. Wait, so Clappers. just reverse everything we said. Oh my god. <laughs> reverse every you guys, you single guys aren't thing we said. To switch sides. You guys aren't allowed to switch sides because by the time we figure out which color's which, you guys are going to switch sides. <laughs> okay. Wow. I'm a little embarrassed. Okay, so I I'm, messed I'm up. I'm not. I'm not. It's, not. it's okay. We're, we're human, Asmin. We're human. Well, Honestly, we're just making it human. way more Make interesting. Yourself. Okay, Mr. Roboto. <laughs> you know, well, maybe your AI was... now. Tiny Donut and Bork Bork on its team. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, we realize now, now that we're seeing this screen at least. <laughs> now we see this screen and we can see hard stuck hard blue. blue. Maybe I, I thought Bibbit make... was blue, hard stuck was red. Maybe we thought Bibbit because B blue. That would just make more sense. How do I yeah. do I have a pencil? Yeah, we got that now, guys. Thanks guys. We appreciate it. 
Okay, so <laughs> so Hardstuck won that map. We got that right, right? Hardstuck <laughs> blue. What are the comments saying? Are they roasting they're us? They're just like, yeah, they're just laughing know, at us. I know, I know my team. I mean, we are. deserve to get fucking laughed at. <laughs> that, that's pretty bad. That's I. Right. That's I. Right. Just reverse it all, guys. Just reverse it all. Reverse it all. Flip that. Flip one eighty. Yeah, good job, good job hard opposite stuck. Opposite day. I don't know if y'all knew it's opposite day, but opposite awesome day. Job. It is opposite day. <laughs> Dang. Yeah. I was like, RK? Or is that code for King's Row? Oh, they're doing it backwards. <laughs> well. Uh, maps. King's Row. Gotta love the classic. Everyone picks it. Classic. We're going to take a look at the map pool here just to give you guys an idea, just so it's on your radar. Looks like we are going to move over to the King's Row. Other choices were Midtown and Paricio. We've opted out of that. those two. Um, and then next map after that will be either Dorado, Shambali, or Route 66. Um, finally, the push maps. And if we get to a map five, it will go back to control. What do you think is going to happen in King's Row, Osmond? Um, I think we are going to finally see um, the, fine, the, the, the once fabled, the uh, dive brig that I've been talking about every single feature match. Okay, Pretty sure we're going to see the rallying brig being teleported with the sim TP into the enemy back line and just killing everyone because that is the <laughs> only strategy. Okay, okay. I do remember that last season, and I will admit I hated it. I hated it. I hate going against it. I hate having to defend and figure out what I'm gonna get, we're gonna do against it. Uh, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if Hardstuck runs a dive. This this can be a. I've seen a couple teams run a defensive dive as well as an offensive dive on first point. Um, I've seen some dive. I've seen a lot of Arisa. I've, I've, I think I've oh, seen yes. a lot of Arisa. Ton I think of Arisa. Arisa is like the main one here. I think. I wouldn't be surprised if Clappers still stick with their Rhine, but it will be interesting to see if they run something else besides their Rhine. It makes sense to run a Rhine on a control map. But Arissa has been a favorite on hybrids lately. I don't know how I feel about it. She's just impossible to kill unless you kill everyone else around her. You get the, okay. if you get the flex support, usually you can pick off the Arissa then. Try Looks to find like a pick on anyone else. Now entering King's Row. Okay. Hardstuck blue, clappers red. Hardstuck blue, clappers red. <laughs> Repeat blue. after me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. We're turning to a song, y'all. Okay, so hardstuck blue. They're going to be defending. Yeah, the blue hardstuck Where's... team does seem to be defending. That is true. <laughs> Also, it does seem like the attacking uh, Clappers. Clappers team yeah. is certainly attacking. Yeah. Um, classy crew on, you know, the Clappers team huh. is playing the Junkrat. As this is very interesting. Both teams are going to run a Sojourn, but neither of them a Mercy, but both of them a Lucio. And Bat. Lucio and Bat. Do you all know something I don't? Is this the is this the call? It's just... Um, Lucio I Bat. Know. I mean... It, App, pretty good at area healing brawl. I mean, you do not get access to the, the really, really powerful Kitsune Rush win condition, um, but you do just get consistent healing. Um, and so that's kind of what you're playing for, I guess, in this one. However, you're um, you're also not um, going to be able to use, like, you don't have Suzu every 14 seconds. You have a Lamp every 25 seconds. So yeah. I, I think there are some disadvantages to BAP. But again, more consistent area healing. You don't miss Very as much. True. So that is where you're going to be mm -hmm. kind of playing for. Also, Clapper's against the May. rushing into the hotel through the back line. Shui finding a kill. Jojo DeVos equalizing the kill with their Lucio and Bork Bork. That's Lamp down for Hardstuck. Clappers could push in with this. Clappers playing their time. They're biding their time. They're waiting for their cooldowns, I think. And they're still have they're, available. Ride, that's oh, Schwinn just said, "Heck you, Cashabelli! I'm gonna go for your back." Oh my God, Schwinn is just in. That was in as you can get. Because the pin, 
Doesn't find anybody. The shatter though oh. comes from uh, cash money. The counter shatter. Oh my. Swain, you are still alive. I think Swain's just like using charge just for the hell of it, honestly. <laughs> I keep seeing him charge and he's just like, Wee! and then he just like lands in some weird spot. <laughs> that was a really, that was pretty good defense for Heartstuck, but that was also a really good attack. For clappers, I think they bided their time well. It was just unfortunate. Uh, I think they had their team had first death, so it was not in their favor after that. It's yeah. hard if you're attacking and you have the first death. You gotta just have to back up, reset. Window comes out. I do like the angle, but are we able to use it? Reaper using it, looks like. Cachavelli coming out prevalent against Schwain. Oh, big time, big time! Big time dies to a hammer. <laughs> but Cachavelli this time's like, I'm the Giga Ryan. I will ride if you. I always love Ryan v Ryan's. I, I love seeing the the uh, solidarity of like, we both know Ryan's not meta, but let's both play Ryan. Hell yeah. <laughs> exactly. It's I think so this real is the first though. time I haven't seen an Arisa. <laughs> Wait, look at this tire. Uh -oh. oh my god. Oh. Wait, Swain just kind of tanked that. He did. I think he did. Kinda just looked at the tire and was like, yeah, I don't give a shit. <laughs> okay. Oh, I see to you, Tiny Donut. Tiny Donut gonna hide in the back and he's just gonna wait. What's he gonna do? He almost oh, coming Tiny's up on him. He might use it. He might find a time to use it. And knows how he's gonna use it. Let's go. Oh, no, no, no. He he saw it and he got the kill and he's like, nah, I'm good. I'm gonna back up. All he has to do is just, you know, get the kill on the, on the back. Oh, I didn't kill the map, actually. Um, wait, did he? He got the kill on the map. Yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, kill in the bat. That's all okay, I gotta do. Okay, hard done. Hard just stuck's done. gonna wait for this choke. Schwain's really in there, but a run. Jumps off. Look at that. Three K from Tiny Donut. From above. That was a beautiful old Tiny Donut. And then great cleanup with your Lucio speed. Hard stuck's awesome. really not giving up this point easily. I'm interested to see what they're going to do. Both teams. Three ults coming in from Clappers, two ready. Wouldn't be surprised to see... The shadow's um, big. Maybe an aggressive beat. Clappers about to lay down the law. Okay, there's the beat. Both MOs come out. Where's the shatter? He's When's it coming? There's a shatter! got Cachavelli that time. Schwain's like, this is my land now. Mine. Pushing the team back. Clappers having to back up. Reset. Wow. Heart stuck holding this corner, holding this alleyway. This corner doing pretty Man. well here for uh, for Heart stuck. Absolutely don't mind holding this little corner over here. Oh, it looks like Clapper's gonna go a different way. That's what you Let's gotta do sometimes. Let's see what they do. Let's just gotta okay. approach from a different angle. I mean, they're gonna hear the they're gonna hear the footsteps, so it's not no surprise. Here comes the shatter. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. It doesn't okay. really do much. They're putting pressure on Schwain. Schwain can't Schwain take it. Down. Okay. Clappers definitely takes that fight. And they address their, or ascertain, assert their dominance on cart. Looks like Hardstuck's just gonna, Sojourn's gonna wait for a nice regroup. Pretty smart, big time if you ask me. Slim Jim Joe gonna just do a little pokey damage. Okay. Look at big Looks time. like Heartstuck's all here, ready for this last fight. I'll pro we're probably gonna see a surgery. That's the angle. Wow. Window comes out first. They're gonna have to dodge this window, but as soon as this window's over, I'm expecting to see an overclock here from big time. Going oh, straight to the high ground here. Oh, shatter from Schwain and Classy Crew. Man, these Reapers matching each other. I'm just telling you. They really are, and I think Reaper is just like a solid pick in uh, between these two teams. Like both teams really just have to play this Reaper. Um, in both teams, you know, they're just playing like this Ryan comp, and I think that uh, the Blossom just looks good on both sides. They're really strong. Very brawly, a very brawly comp. Mm -hmm. Both teams like really heavily brawl, really stacked up together, makes these Blossoms really powerful. See Tiny Donut just like removing uh, Jojo DeBoss off of that high ground. There's a window from Heartstuck and a counter beat from Clappers. 
Clappers just back up. Hard stuff take the space. No kills yet. If anything, they just take space, but both teams, I think, acted and reacted the way you would. Indeed, still a massive ult advantage for uh, for Hearthstuck over here. Hearthstuck may be trying to just farm their ult, so then they can have ult advantage. They already have it. I mean, they, right now, they just need to like get this Reaper ult, which is coming right now. Tiny Donuts jumping off oh. the high ground. Gonna kill two. Tiny Donut. Oh, the Emerald yep. comes out to support him. Gotta love those moments, supports. Not quite Broke enough, though. Comes out with the beat. That was, that was a good okay. cleanup there. Good, good ult there uh, from Tiny Donut just hiding in that uh, little alcove up here on the top. Both tanks have shatter, so we're going to see a shatter v shatter. But Heartstuck does have the advantage so far on Sojourn ult. Okay, <laughs> Schwank throws it. it. Cachavalli just blocks it. Cachavalli. Oh, oh doesn't my. find anyone. Man, they're really going match for match. <laughs> Yeah, this is, looking, see... this is looking really even, honestly. Sojourn's fighting. Let's see what this other Sojourn, both Sojourn's ulted. <laughs> both the Reapers. Yeah, it's really... Oh, and they're just mirror comping. Getty in chat says needs more Brig, and I agree with that, Getty. Very good. Yep. More Brig. <laughs> needs more Brig. 100% needs more Brig. <laughs> Where's the die, Brig? Look at the Reaper flank again from Tiny Donut. This could be nasty. A little flank down here. They don't see this coming. It's going to kill the Bap here. Oh. Bap, I don't think, survives Schwank this. Schwank shields down. But Schwank finds a kill on Super. Ooh, Classic okay. Crew evens the score by taking out Tiny. Slinjo takes out Castavelli. Oh, here comes a Classic Crew ult. I see crew kind of okay. just cleaning up. So, yeah, every other fight just seems like one of the Reapers is going to clean up, yes. up a bunch of kills and yes. pretty much all it's about. It's kind of like whose DPS pops off more or whose support keeps their DPS alive. Oh! Oh, I'm going to shout it. so old on the Contagious. Them. Yes, they just wanted to secure that kill because they do have spawn advantage. Heartstuck does. Tiny Donut has no Wraith form, gonna die here, and now, really, Borkborg Bork just has to survive. Borkborg Bork not able to survive Ooh. here. Anyone can be able to touch, Bap's not gonna be able to touch. Not fast enough. Hell yeah, Clappers. You don't got time, but you got all three points. That's what matters. Score. Zero. Honestly, just getting it to the third point is the realest struggle sometimes. Heck, have an extra time. Just getting it to the third point. Definitely. Wow, so heavy brawl there, brawl v brawl. I wonder now if we're going to see either team elect to swap their strategy a little bit. So we're, we're seeing a lot, we're just seeing like basic, like Rhine Reaper brawl. No May. Didn't see any May come up there. Didn't see any Kiriko come out. Um, just like the standard Reaper Sojourn, Lucio, Lucio Bap. Not, not any variation from Hardstuck on the left. But a little bit of a variation on the right. We're do we are going to see this Junkrat, and I think this is actually pretty good. Um, Junkrat able to um, apply a lot of like AOE damage in these brawls, and, just and it's break just a super shield. easy. Oh yeah, the shield breaks you amazing. Break a Ryan shield. It's like it's Ooh, like Ryan having a Reaper with range, right? Because like a Reaper yes. doesn't get to do much damage from like twenty meters, but like you know, there's no fall off damage for Junkrat, so he can still be effective from that range and just find random crap kills. Um, and that's I, I think super valuable in this matchup, so it's a good play. Now, big time, gonna start on the Widowmaker here. I wonder if they're gonna stay or if it's just a couple shots and swap back to Sojourn. Looks like Clapper's gonna mine that LOS. I'm sure they pointed out that Widow. Yep, this is gonna big be time well. going back. Yep, here comes the Sojourn pick mm -hmm. again. I'm just surprised I'm not seeing a Mercy even on the defense with a Sojourn. Well, they are playing the Rhine, so uh, yeah, I absolutely think that Mercy totally does have potential for value here. Look at Tiny Donut on this flank. I think they know he's there. Like, I think they gave away the footsteps a little bit there. It's really good that uh, Classy has a trap in there. Doesn't yeah. make it as accessible. 100% oh, agree. Tiny Donut going the other way. Tiny Donut wraithing out. Rhine v. Rhine right now. Those coming on. Oh, I definitely have to say both baps. 
Well, you okay, take care for Hardstuck. it looks stuck. like, yeah, Hardstuck really taking that fight really quickly. A little more, a little oh, less no. than two minutes. Contagious, buddy. Oh no, you pulled a me. No, you Hold pulled a me. me. No, I'm calling dibs on that, pulling me. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Give me dibs on that. <laughs> Oh no, that's a contagious. That's how it happens. Okay, Clapper's gonna play this corner defending. Looks like they're gonna wait for Contagious to get back because that speed's very useful. Whereas Hardstuck's gonna take advantage of this, and hopefully, I'm sure their aim is to push it past this choke. But let's we'll see what happens. Who's this? Here comes a shatter from Hardstuck. Doesn't find anybody. Here comes an Seems Emo. So aggressive. Emo goes down. Oh, nice. Oh, but this window. window is great, though. I think the yeah, shatter was too early, but this window's good. Now, this tire coming up up the right alley. I wonder if it's going to be able to find anyone. It is going to find the Rhine again, but the Rhine just tanks it for a second time. Actually, I think it was the other way around, but like still. That's crazy. Rhine's just like tanks these tires. I'm seeing really good synergy from Slim Jim and Schwain on Hardstuck. Slim Jim's really doing his best to support his aggressive Rhine. I do see Cashavel. Oh, look at the other! Super's doing his best to stick to Cashavel and Blue too. These teams really are similar. Absolutely very, very are. similar. They're doing a good job of playing their roles. I wonder how Classy, uh, Classy Crew is going to play this. We're, we're looking, I think he's just trying to find like a, a trap play on the ground there. Yeah, okay, just trying to find a flank. Put the trap on the flank. Taking the choke. He wants okay, Ryan to come to the Okay, so we're gonna play Ryan. Cash the wants to shatter. I bet you he knows Schwain does not have shatter. He's gonna look for it. Whoa. Oh, there it oh, is. Look at the shatter countering this beat. Okay. That was really nice. He takes some space, but not this a whole a lot. This is Ryan. <laughs> oh no, Classy in the back getting looked at. No, Classy. See, Clapper's down. Jojo boss finding a kill on big time. Hell yeah, hell yeah, putting that pressure in JoJo. Okay, looks like Hardstuck trying to find their footing. They understand they're down one, so they're pushing a little slow. Okay, another act. Oh, well, it's both sides, but look at this window. I mean, it's like you can't do much if you're um, if you're on clappers here. <laughs> clappers holding on. They're holding. They're making Hardstuck fight for this alley. They're this, making uh, blossom fight. coming. Oh my god, Jojo, Jojo saw that blossom coming from a mile yes. away. All tire. The MO got taken out. Flapper's really holding this. Uh, definitely looks like there is a little bit of an ult advantage on Hardstuck currently. So hopefully they're able to use this to their advantage. But Clapper's really putting up a strong defense down this alley. Some great defense. I really like the awareness from Jojo to know that the Blossom is coming to take a quick 1v1 up there in the brew. That was nice stuff from uh, Jojo, keeping the team alive. Not letting that Blossom kill the entire back line again. Tiny Donut's going to be looking for something else, though. Here, here he is in the back, again. And they prevent this. The lamp comes okay. down. Uh, almost. He tried. It almost. It was the, close. The dominoes have fallen though, and I think they're continuing to fall here. Um, I don't know that you can still win this if you are on the clappers. Um, I think this fight is lost. You have to play for the next one, but I mean, stall as long as you can, obviously. Good stuff. Contagious uh, playing the wall game. He's contagious like, up there? like, yeah, contagious. Okay, just uh, pulling a bit of a frost. Oh my god, just beats off of the catwalk <laughs> onto point. It hasn't been capped yet. Oh, window comes out from Hardstuck. It's so close to getting capped, Hardstuck though. finding a couple kills. Yes, point Contagious two. Contagious is still chilling. Contagious is still alive. just touches. Oh, hey. he dies that second. He almost got out. He almost got out. It's okay. It's okay. I Okay, looks like Clapper's gonna have to have a solid regroup at the moment, but they want to fight for this corner and not give. Uh, oh wait, 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 Clappers. Yeah, they don't want to give Hardstuck too much space. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, I know what happened there, Oh was my. Like Whoa. Okay. Okay. Probably the most that stylish play really I've seen so far. Fight. Wow. Yes. yes. 
That was that was pretty stylish. I will points for style. Good. He was falling with style. I think Swain got some good luck from the chatter that wished him uh, that Swain was like awesome in the chat over here. So, oh, what's going on? But let's go, Swain. <laughs> Swain pulls that off. Clappers. <laughs> oh, unfortunately, the tire gets broke from the clappers, but there's a fat shatter from Cachavelli. Emo comes out to support the fight. Okay, all oh, they got. Oh, and I don't blame him. I don't blame you, Slim Jim. I don't blame you. I'd do the same thing. I'd do the same thing. Deny bolt charge. We're seeing a swap to Banana Rush from Hearthstuck here. Uh, a team comp that worked for them pretty well on the last map. So, see what they can pull off here. They're going to immediately deny this high ground. Contagious going to have to jump off. And now, Hearthstuck has a lot of high ground control at the moment. Clapper is trying to figure out what they're going to have to do. Probably just let the dive come to them. That's super Catch belly into Hearthstuck. swing. Is this definitely one of the harder Ah, this is going to be rough. Uh, they're having trouble finding a dive target right now, and so yes. this is getting uh, kind of rough. Like, Trace is already killing. dead at the moment, so I mean, you're already 4v5. There's Lamp down, though. That's a big start. Once Lamp is down, you can start finding something, but here now, you're down your Reaper, so you're again going to be 4v5. Looks like Hardstock's going to back up. They really got to gather together here. Left. I mean, because 26 seconds. It's not really any room for like goofing around at this point. They are coming up on four ults. I, I wouldn't be surprised if that whole fight was just for them to build their ults. Oh, here comes out a window. Ooh, classy TPing out. He doesn't have his ult, but Cachavelli does. So let's Blossom's see. Blossom's gotta Cachavelli be it. Honestly, anyway. seven seconds. This has to be the everything Blossom. Yeah, this. They we have four ults from Hearthstuck. Oh, oh the shatter just immediately kills Tiny Donut. Oh, but now Rush and Blossom are going to come down. This is not an overfight yet. But Catch it is not looking Slim good Jim. if you're on the hard stuck side. Shwain is doing everything he can to boot. Now he's just got to survive and stall. But Clappers, oh. <laughs> Somebody. Big time found a super. Unfortunate, but Super did get that MO out. So that was great. And wow. Clappers takes it. I, this looks like it's going to be a, a five-map game, Osman. These yeah. guys look very... Uh, they look pretty even. Yeah, especially when it came to their mirror comps. They definitely looked even. <laughs> I am interested to see if uh, Clappers run something beyond the brawl. Woo! But I do bag was nice. Uh, I do commend Hardstuck on recognizing that their brawl just wasn't, it didn't seem like it was doing it. So they did try to switch it up. So that's, you can't fault them for that. It wasn't successful, but they at least understood that they needed to switch it up and try something else to secure it. Yeah, they, they definitely tried. They did their best and uh, mm -hmm. it wasn't, it wasn't terrible there. That's actually a pretty tough place to brawl. And so, um, or if I say to, to dive, it's, it's like kind of a yes. closed space. And so it's really hard to actually like find a dive target and, and make a dive work there. I think that if you are going to dive that, that's one of the situations where having that pendulum from Wrecking Ball might actually just be kind of the play. So mm -hmm. I know that sounds weird, but I actually kind of like Wrecking Ball if you're going to try to dive there. Um, but I mean, obviously Monkey is still fine <laughs> for the strategy. We got Escort Max. They're going to select Route 66. Ooh, has that one been played yet? Um, I believe it has. While we're waiting okay. for that, we're going to take a look at the players to watch. takes like <laughs> with the enemy team <laughs> We're swapping tanks Sheesh, okay okay oh or like as in in the same so same lineup oh they got a new dude chaotic chaotic okay chaotic for cash wait you're taking out cash money i know hold up You gotta have cash money. <laughs> All right. 
So you got the team's perspectives going perfect. Yes. Thank you, thank you. JoJo and Classy with their DPS. Yep, yep, yep. Really appreciate all the peanut butter icons from Hardstuck. Thank you very much for that. <laughs> so, since this is Route 66, I will not, I hope Hardstuck plays dive. I think the first two points of this map is great for dive. I agree. And I think that we're probably going to see some dive come out here. Let's see what Chaotic brings to the table. What's the chat saying? They, they like my players to watch. A little, I'll, I'll put it one more time. They, they're enjoying the uh, players to watch leaderboard where we have Apollo on the brig from uh, first feature match. Brig dive attempts per 10, 69. Frog facts given per 10 minutes, 27. Total career death, zero, of course. Never dies. And uh, bottom text, negative, negative nine, because I couldn't think of anything else. <laughs> okay. It's funny. I enjoy this. I need to make more of them. Okay, looks like both teams are ready. Oh yeah, last time we did see this match, we actually saw Apollo on the brig. Traveling to Inspiring me. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I hope that? Brig gets a rework. I hope she does. She's like, she's pretty fun. It's just. You have to play her in certain situations. She's not like a pick you can just play any time. Definitely not. Like, you know, Lucio or... Or... Kiriko. Yeah. Okay, so we got hard stuck, blue, defending. And we have clappers attacking as red. Just wanted to reassert that out there. Ooh, a Ramatra. Still sticking with the Lucio Bap. And we got Classy on the Reaps. All right. Okay, looks like we're going to be speeding their new tank around. And we got a defensive dive. Defensive dive. From Hardstuck. Okay, let's see how this goes. I haven't seen a Ramatra really have to deal with a a dive comp yet. So I definitely want to see how clappers handle that. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm interested too. I don't think I've seen a Ramatra on attack versus uh, like a, a monkey dive defense before. I've seen it the other way yeah. around like yeah. plenty of times, yeah. right? This is like the opposite of what I'd expect. And here, clappers gathering together, just trying to push the cart here. There's no reason to make a play until the cart's around the corner, obviously. Uh, oh, so they're just yeah. chilling. They realize they're playing against the monkey. Okay, take it slow and steady, slow and steady. Looks like Schwain's assessing a target. This might be a soft dive. Not looking for kills. Ooh, Contagious finds big time. I always love it when Lucio gets a kill. <laughs> don't do it. Just kill yeah, on the coast. Yes. Oh my god. Yes, Contagious, go. Schwain jumping out, he's like, I'm out -y. Man. Clapper's making really good time on this point so far. I don't think Hardstuck is able to find a good dive target. They're really just being patient. They're trying, but they're they're having to wait. Absolutely, and I think so far, um, Clappers have played this super well, like really defensively. They know they're getting dived in a lot, and now what I'm seeing differently from this map that I saw um, from the first map Oasis. is that they're defending against these dives. like a lot better in my opinion yes they definitely learned from first map we gotta protect our back line guys <laughs> um, but it looks like hard stuff's able to hold it they hold Barely. it right right five six meters <laughs> got me close guys that is okay not clappers. a long amount of distance so that was very close um, hard stuff does have rush as well as primal or rush coming up and then primal Maybe, and then it looks like I wouldn't be surprised if Clappers pops a Ramatra ult with maybe Sojourn. 
but one or the other. They're gonna open the fight with Rush from Hearthstuck. Swain finds Jojo. Big Time finds Classy. That was a great Ooh. dive from Hearthstuck. This is that, fantastic that was, stuff. Great that cleanup. Was great. Yeah, I, don't, like I don't think uh, they're remodulers Clappers. here. Clappers didn't use an ult, but I'm sure they're going to take the initiative on this next push. But we do see that four ults on each side. Almost five from uh, Clappers. They're rushing in. They're going to come in. What ult they're going to start off with? They're going to take that high ground. Walk it. Walk it. Okay, here comes Blade from Tiny Donut. Oh Whoa. my gosh. Big Time finds a great pulse. Big Time finds a big pulse. And Borg Borg finds a headshot on Classy. Let's go. Wow. Lucio Gaming. Okay. Yep. Defensive dive. Borg Borg. Oh, man. I think Clappers is just really struggling to get their ult out first. I think so, too. I do because hope they go to the high ground again. This is now the second, almost third fight they're walking into, and they haven't been able to use it all. Okay, and going underneath. bottom tunnel. And now, well, there's a lot of ults that are potentially happening from bit, uh, from Clappers on this one. Hardstuck just starts off with a Primal. And Hardstuck, I mean, they don't seem to be, like, on any particular target. They're just kind of, like, fighting. It seems like it's getting really scrappy here. We get Lamp coming out of uh, the Clappers. They're really just playing kind of on the low, and I think it's doing well for them. They just control this Mega inside a gas station and just, like, camp. I think they can pull this off. I don't see what kind of dive... You're gonna get from, uh, from the other team at the moment. Although with the beat coming in, that does give you the safety to just kind of rush on the point and do whatever you want. This oh, is where it's comes. going to change, though. This yep. is where I mean, just stay on the point. You should be able to push this out now. The uh, Winston Bear is actually gonna do something here. Gonna this room is not gonna end. Just he dies or someone gets out of this Pretty room. Much. They actually, actually killed the Ramatra, though. Wow, this defense. It's still not over. Schwein Very close game right now. On now Slim oh, Jim's man. back on the Kiriko. Borg Borg's still kind of touching. Him. Both teams just struggling to stay alive on point and trying to like find who's off point shooting from a distance, who's able to be on point. Mind you, we're in overtime. Yeah, both we're teams are realizing this. <laughs> okay, JoJo finds a kill on Slim Jim. That's pretty fast of a kill if you ask me. I think uh, Clappers is taking over here. Now that they've gotten a couple of kills, I don't think that uh, Hardstuck can find any more reinforcements on point. I mean, aside from like the Primaling Winston, who's no, no longer got Primal, this barrier is going to be gone. He doesn't have jump. Now he's jumping. He's stalling. Is, he's stalling as much as he can. Here's Kiriko. Right, big time. Oh, Kiriko Slim Jim. And at this point, you're not really getting any, oh. any extra time because it's been on overtime the whole time. At this point, it does look like it's a bit of feeding. Um, we're going to get I try. flat two and a half minutes on the clock. Hardstuck does have ult advantage, I think. Hardstuck is a little bit ahead, they're yeah. They're coming up on beat. Yep, they're coming up on beat. They're going to build pulse, I'm sure, in this next fight. It's actually it's a little closer to even. than well, It's not like actually, that far I see ahead. it, yeah. yeah okay. It's, it's a little close. Not too far off. Okay, Hardstuck going to reassess who their targets are. Clapper's going to just play around point for their life. They're not going to give Hardstuck an easy dive. Okay, here comes a blade with the dive. Here's the play. Emo comes out. Oh, Tiny finds Classy as well as Contagious. Blitzboard finds Super. Okay, it looks like Hardstuck really had a game plan and they followed through with it. They secured the first kill, and the rest seemed to be history for them. Well timed for them too. I mean, they had yes. like the blade straight and in, into the beginning of the fight. As soon as they engaged, it looked like some solid synchronized pressure mm -hmm. there. They didn't even dive. use another ult. They didn't use another ult. Very good. Well played. Very good. We're gonna see. Okay, uh, clappers. Okay, there's Clapp there's a the lamp. <laughs> Hell yeah! Stick the mo. You got it. I expect a big overclock okay. here potentially. Ooh, here comes a beat. Hearts to, oh, you get beat on both meeting, sides. Matching the beat. Contagious gets oofed off the map. Unfortunate. Jojo boss. Everyone just collapsing on Chaotic. I think they got very spread out after uh, Clapper's beated. I felt like 
everyone was just trying to run away for their lives in different directions. That was really yeah. rough. That tough, that tight tunnel. I still like the tunnel though because the amount of space between the tunnel and like the overall like average position for um, for hard stuck right now, they have to do like use a bunch of cooldowns in order to like match them at the tunnel, and that's where you can start like playing more poke and try to poke them out of their uh, out of their dive. Ooh, Jojo popping, he finding both supports of hard stuck. This is probably gonna be their most favorable fight. Probably. Good job. Razor is trying really to stall as much old... as possible though. Big time here, not willing to go down without a fight. Not even okay, interested I in, like, do the believe our stuck understand that they are in OT. They do have some time. They have. Oh, Reaper's gonna come meet Schwain in the face. Boops him back. And Hard Stuck's really just trying to get a full five regroup. Okay, we got Kitsune Rush. Maybe overshot a little bit. We're Probably gonna see a Nemesis popping off though. Oh man. And our, what do you call this Armageddon? Something like that. <laughs> Annihilation, that's the one. I definitely feel like this is Clappers is win condition. Just try to keep the Ramatra up. Just try to Oh man. Ramatra's well, gotta it stay alive here. Oh my god. Finding all the kills. They're just wow. saying, heck that Ramatra or we don't care, we're gonna kill the rest of your team. <laughs> Some of the strongest counterplay to Ramatra I've seen in a while. Or Ramatra's old. Like, sure. I, I, I usually see this like around the end of like these capture points just it's just like so consistently winning the fight and, and in this it doesn't seem to be doing so and so it seems like really good target focus perhaps from uh hard stuck like enabling them to not really succumb to it yes i do believe this is so uh, i think the biggest difference between these teams is that hard stuck just plays can play dive and i don't think we've seen anything dive related from clappers so far they, yeah. they have figured out how to adjust their comps to make it work against a dive, but on this map, I do believe the first two points are in favor of a dive comp. I do agree with that. and uh... I think if they got to third point, they probably would have definitely... Uh, I think they would have... Hardstuck would have had to switch. Would have had to switch it up. Okay, we're running the same comp from the Clappers on defense. Not and not just like Mercy, huh? Okay, I we just want to ignore the Mercy meta. Mercy doesn't exist. I don't know what you're talking about. She exists. She exists. Right. She exists when you don't want her to. True. That's actually true. <laughs> yeah, I'm expecting to see um, see some staging here right in the beginning. Uh, they do actually want to like push the card up to the first corner and what's weird what i'm seeing here from uh the clappers is clappers not really interested in just like holding on top of gas station they really just they're actually trying to hold this first corner and i actually i don't mind that too much i think their most well their most range character is jojo so indeed they are opting into running the reaper here to try to be as anti-dive as they possibly can yes they are a brawl team um, so as far as I understand, they are a brawl team, and that is their strongest. And they I... probably just want to plan. Contagious, I see you. C Contagious, oh I feel you. You're you're that guy who goes on the aggressive moves. I like it. Keep it up. A fancy frog, if you will. A <laughs> fancy frog. I love it. The fancy <laughs> frog award. That should be one. That should be one. Write it. Write it down. <laughs> write it down. Tell it to critic. Write it down. And boom. So let in the chat remember. <laughs> the fancy frog award. Yes. Meanwhile, Frost okay. just gives herself the fancy frog award. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, okay. You're just gonna give me a run for my money. <laughs> okay, fair okay, enough. Okay, and Mo comes out from Clappers. They don't have it. What ults? Looks pretty even on the ults, but Big Time's gonna find his ult first. So let's see if he uses it to turn the fight in favor of hard stuff. Big time doesn't need to, he just secures a kill. I like it. Slim Joe on an alternate angle. He's gonna back up, reassess. Awesome pressure from big time. Clappers is really defending this corner. I gotta give it to them. They're defending this corner. They're gonna give them just as much hard time as hard stuff gave to them on attack. Yeah, I think so. And I, I'm I'm seeing like absolutely right. This corner is doing really well because like you, you don't really get a whole lot of vantage over over this corner. I mean, you've got the top right high ground. Look at this! Look at this annihilation! What are you gonna do about this? Like, how do you play around this? They just have to beat in response. 
Oh, Chaotic doesn't find enough people to just hide on the high ground. Here comes Blade from Tiny. Tiny Donut looking for the Lucio. Does find He's Contagious. Contagious, yep. It'd be like that. Oh, here comes Classy's ult. It finds two. Wow. Uh, I believe this is a 3v3. Pretty tiny donut actually just deflected that entire blossom and it didn't like kill the kill classy. Okay, we are back to a three v three now. Which three v three prevails? It does seem oh uh, shame. Cotton four K. Unfortunate. Um, <laughs> 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 this is not a four K stream. <laughs> we better make it four K now. Oh, I can't handle that. My internet not good enough. <laughs> Damn, clappers, you really holding this map? You really hold in this corner. This is great oh, defense. Man. I mean, it's the not over yet. It's definitely not over yet. But look at the ult economy. I mean, really just relying pulse. on big time to pull something out of their uh, butt here. And there's just more ults in the, in favor of uh, the Clappers. Clappers ready to just hold this down. I'm seeing an overclock from JoJo potentially coming out any moment now. Man, Super, you Pulse really did this. It was perfect. You g great job, Super. I see you. Okay, here comes out a window. As oh, well as the Matra ult. Okay. Okay, they really said no, we're we're securing this. Hey, we wanna hold this. Okay. From Hardstuck, they're coming up on B. And there's one they're more coming fight, up though. on Rush. We'll see if any other ults neither team has ults. Maybe beat for aggro. Maybe beat. Maybe. Four seconds left. There's beat potentially coming from both teams if this fight lasts a long time, which I imagine it probably will. We'll see. Maybe not. Trying to take some damage. Wayne. Arsec just picks up two pieces. I mean, that's that's enough. That's enough to like drag that this all the way out. Okay. Clapper's having to back up. Both supports are alive, but they're gonna have to back Super up. Super gotta so get out of there. Yeah. Indeed. Gotta get out of there. Cross got a long way to go. There's definitely another touch here. Um, if I'm looking at yes. ults, I'm still seeing about probably a beat going to come out from both sides. Um, Slim Jim coming out from a rush. I think that's going to be the most impactful thing coming out right here. Um, going to probably have to beat in response to that rush if you're if you're Another. on clappers. Oh. Wait, the C9. Oh. Hard stuck. No. Cotton 4K. I think oh the right no. Team, but like, why did you? No, dude. I feel like I got cheated. I got, I got cheated, cheated out of the rest of the game. There was such a fight left to be had. Uh, we have this. That's we're coming out. Oh man. Okay. Well, that was really well played from Hardstuck. Wow. We're not Hardstuck. Well, both teams well played, but Clappers, you defended first point really well. I, you just denied Hardstuck's dive, and that was you did the thing. You did the thing. The thing has been done. The done the, <laughs> did, did, the thing it did, did. Yeah, exactly. So we are at... What is the score right now? It's uh, so two map. in favor of Clappers, and Hardstack has one, I think. Okay. I think. Wait a minute. Let me look at my map pool for just a minute. Hardstuck? Yeah, so there's one, one, both sides, and then on Escort, Clappers went to two, one. Okay, yeah. And so... Um, Hardstuck's gonna have to win the push map here, whichever that's gonna be. It's gonna be uh, Hardstuck's map choice. <laughs> Chat's just now catching up with the C9 with the letter number. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Coliseo is gonna be the map pick here. I think we're still getting made fun of. People are saying now number letter nine C. I think I think I'm feeling personally attacked right now. <laughs> <laughs> they want Coliseo. Coliseo. My team. My what are team people calling for Coliseo. Um, I've seen. I don't know. I've, I've seen. I think have all the features match. All the feature matches been Coliseo. Has it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't I'm know. not really like. I think it's the most satisfying symmetrical of all the maps. Like symmetrically yeah. satisfying. Like when you look at it from a yeah. spectator view, it's it's definitely satisfying. Most satisfying. Yeah. Whereas New Queen Street just looks like a snaky map. Kind of yeah. weird. <laughs> hard to see the symmetry. It's there, but it's hard to see it. Esperanza's pretty though. I like that one. Oh, Esperanza is pretty. 
Let me see. Okay. It looks like Heartstuck wants to take the halftime for 10 minutes. So it looks like, I don't know if you take a break or if we talk for 10 minutes. Um, I'll pull up the BRB screen and we'll take a 10 minute break. All right, guys. All right.
All right, we are back from the break. Um, it is just about time to continue on with the fun. So as soon as y'all done playing putt party in there, yeah, I see you. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go back to your back to your places. Back to your places. <laughs> back to your places. Okay, I Wait, got hold it on, ready. Hold on, hold on, just stop a second. Hold from on. Someone stuck. from lobby one needs to mute. Mm. It's the coach. There we go. Squashy, squashy. Okay. You good? All right. Okay, I'm waiting for clappers. If they ready? Oh no, they are ready. Bet. Okay, you're good on your side. I'm good. Okay, I'm good on my We're side. We're all good. Coliseo, ladies and gents. Arriving at Coliseo. Who loves push? Not me. Not me. <laughs> Not me. None of us. <laughs> <laughs> no one in this lobby in particular. Overwatch, the real Overwatch players hate push. <laughs> yeah. It's, it, it's I, okay. There's been a few times I've enjoyed it, it when it's like really neck and neck. But yeah, I mean, it's just like... Some some games just feel so inevitable. Close. Classy says you are a god. I already knew this though. <laughs> no, he's he's a robotic god. Robotic. I'm gonna type that. Robotic, <laughs> robotic god. God. Mm. Watch the stream, you'll understand. Indeed. Nothing wrong with being a robot. I honestly think cyborgs are the future. Cyborgs are the future. Okay, both teams. Hard stuff gonna run their divey dive. Clapper's gonna run their brawly brawl with the Ramatra. Same comps as last time. Let's see who prevails on push. I think actually um, the Ramatra comp looks pretty good here. It depends. It really depends on like how aggressive Schwinn's like jump in with bubble is. Like this, it really I think just comes down to this. This bubble either protects his team and like has like an insane utility, or it's just too weak and then the dive wasn't come out okay hardstuck wanting to play on the outside clapper's gonna meet them on the outside we're just saying hit the robot it doesn't unlock it's That's not a huge unlock. jump oh and De and hardstuck finds the first kill takes that momentum now it looks like they're potentially gonna clean up the fight classy has no raid so he's gonna have to fight chaotic just gonna back up he's like yeah i'm out of here boys i'm out of here Oh no, Chaotic! I don't know if Chaotic knows the map! I don't think he meant okay. to be there. Oh. oh no, his team couldn't get there. What a huge stagger for Hardstuck. It's okay, they're going to have Contagious okay. to speed him back. So we're going to get another fight here pretty pretty quickly. And as we're getting there, it just looks like the highest ult charge is Big Time. Big Time coming up with a lot of damage there. Ready to find this, uh, find the last damage he needs to pull off this Pulse Bomb. I really want to highlight how often I've seen Big Time have Pulse. Yeah. Like, he might not always stick it, but good god, he has it every fight. So kudos to that. Definitely. And we see Chaotic swapping over to the recent. I think I I don't mind that Ooh. swap. Um, I I think the Ramantra is still like, pretty good, but the, the Javelin is actually going to potentially be clutched, depending on how good Chaotic is at hitting that Javelin. The, uh, the yeeting of the pulse bomb. It's absolutely and nothing. Looks like the rest of me and the rest of our stuff's like, we're gonna back up now. We're gonna group. This is gonna give some good push time to the clappers with their Arissa as tank now versus a Ramatra. I think this is definitely gonna be. This can be very much in their favor if they play tight together. It's gonna give Schwain a harder time to just pick a dive target. Classy watching the back. Looks like he's looking out for big time. Definitely marking the tracer pretty well. Although, just because you can mark tracer pretty well doesn't mean you can mark big time pretty well. Like big time knows what he's doing on this tracer. Okay, Schwain coming in primaling, causing some chaos. Looks like Hardstuck's gonna respond to that. Classy's just gonna ult on point, clear that real quick, and then they split up. Hardstuck. 
Clapper's just gonna hang out around point. Ooh, really good focus fire from Heartstuck. As per, as to be expected, the Arissa is the last to die. I can definitely see why you would leave Arissa. Yeah. I think they're, I think Heartstuck's die priorities are definitely, it's, even though they, Clapper's does have an Arissa, they understand they have to kill everything else. Hmm, we got four ults from Clappers. Two ults from, oh, here comes a blade. Yeah, here comes a beat to match it. Tiny Donut not gonna find much here. A nice window, nice little aggressive window. Heartstuck's having to reassess and they're all hardcore backing up. They're backing up pretty far here, yeah. Um, we still have, we still see more cart progress from Hardstuck than uh, Clappers at the moment. So Clappers are gonna have to win like multiple fights in a row to really pull his advantage back. At least two fights in a row, maybe three actually. Okay, okay. This is definitely looks to be in a Clapper's favor. Nope, never mind. Tiny Donut finds a kill and Troy jumps. Okay, hard stuff. They really following up on this dive. I'm seeing a lot of assists from their Lucio Bork Bork. So whoever you are, you're doing a good job. I see you. I see you in the kill feed. See you in the kill feed. <laughs> I see the assists. Okay, Schwein taken. Yes, yeah, you see? He has it like a fight. Ooh. Close. Doesn't find anyone, but that's okay. It was the MO that saved him. Oh no, JoJo found big time. So it looks like um, Hardstuck here having trouble in the same spot every single time, really kind of finding difficulty finding a dive there. And it makes, it makes you wonder if they should start thinking about taking the fight from a different position. Um, maybe, or maybe they're, swap they're... the comp. But, but it's not, not working because they still are 63 meters to 30, and so if they, if this match just keeps going the way it has been, um, where they just trade fight wins over and over and over again, then Heartstuck will win. It is called push. Yep. You just gotta push it further. Kind of like running from a bear. You just gotta be faster than the slowest person. Indeed. <laughs> oh, you're gonna get out, Bork Bork? Oh, you don't get out. out. It's okay. It's all right. Okay, but that is a really good pattern that you notice, Asmin. Like they are struggling to fight after they're push trying to push it toward butt scratch. Did and then like right now, um, this is where the fight gets really hard for uh, for clappers. It's so open. <laughs> it's so open. It's so easy to dive this area of the map. And it, I would love what I'm seeing here from clappers. They're just giving it up. They're like, no, no, no. We're not pushing the card anymore until we get a fight. <laughs> Look how careful the Clappers are playing. Smart, are playing. Though. Both playing smart. Like, you don't see Hardstuck playing aggro. You don't see Clappers trying to be too much. But somebody's a playmaker here, guys. A bit, but yeah, I mean, what's interesting here is I love what Clappers is doing. I love the caution. But when it comes down to it, at the end of the day, you have to make a play because you're behind. Like, um, Hardstuck doesn't have to do anything. Now, they end up doing something here. They actually do pull out the blade. They make it. They have a fight come out. And they are going to get, get it in their favor still. here. That was really patient gameplay from both mm -hmm. sides. It was just, uh, I think the ops, uh, Heartstuck's blade really was just too fast. And it it was nullified, or wasn't even nullified from Super's uh, window to scare him away. And the Orisa ult, Chaotic ulted as well. He unfortunately didn't catch their Genji. Whoa, Tiny Don is like really far in there now. Kind of okay. just sneaks out. Chaotic steals the robot. Okay. Uh, a little bit of a, a little clumsy play there. Um, they're going to regroup here. Um, Hardstuck. I think they just had like a couple people in and they didn't really like realize who was in and who wasn't. So um, they're going to they're gonna regroup though. And I think this fight's going to go back in their favor again. I mean, they still have a couple of good ults available. They have the support ults. Um, coming like halfway to their, their primal. That's going to do well for them. Although we are seeing the cart now. Push a lot more in favor mm -hmm. of uh, Clappers. Clappers beat to Clappers match the Kirko ult yeah. from Slim Jim. And we see Jojo. But it doesn't seem like it's much use for the team. Oh, here comes beat from Bork Bork for hard stuff so they can try to push it a little further or defend it. Swaying I mean. on Contagious. 
It's gonna secure that kill on Contagious. Oh no, Classy turns around and then supports a support. Yeah, Clapper's Look looking really low HP right now. Everyone's kind of like super duper low, and so they're gonna hey fall God, down. So but close. what we can see now is progress, though, because it's not 60 to 30 anymore. It's 60 to about 60. So yeah, we do still see an advantage in favor of Hardstuck, but it's a lot closer this time. Now it just takes like one more fight win here um, for us to potentially see the the lead flipped. Oh, there's only less than two minutes left. It looks like, yeah, oh, Clapper is perfectly content not Jojo. taking that. Oh, wait a minute. Big time found Jojo. I think that's going to be a U-turn for, um, for Hardstuck. Oh, Classy in the, the back fight. line, but all of Hardstuck back up. He finds nobody. Schwein jumping on her. The tank probably going to just play in his bubble for this time being. It's a 4v5. I know it's a 5v5. I mean, it's just stalling. I mean, like, nothing has to happen here. And if nothing happens, Hearthstuck just wins. We got one minute left. And that's what we need to see, too. If Hearthstuck wins this, we do get to map five, because then we're going to be 2-2. Two, two. But if if uh, Clappers wins this, then Clappers takes the, takes the, takes the match. Ooh. Robot's just at a standstill. Tiny Donut on the robot. Are they going to get butt scratch? Slim Jim Joe pumps out his ult on the bridge. Not His team's not able to utilize it except big time, though. Wow, okay. Ooh, they didn't get much of a push. Well, with they 30 seconds remaining, though, so, like, yeah, they didn't really add any distance to their uh, to their path there. Um, but now we see the, the car kind of taking momentum in the other direction, and this is going to be the mountain that they're going to have to climb because they're going to have to win a fight, Brawl v. Dive, Coming up here, and it's it's not in their favor. And this map geometry does not favor Brawl <laughs> versus Dive. This is where it's going to be really tough. This is the moment of opportunity. Here comes Blade from Tiny Donut. The MO. MO? No MO? Cool. It's so close. Okay. Actually. Yeah, it is. This is very brawly. Clapper's well, everything they can, but that beat in the <laughs> perfect time here is going to actually probably close this favor out. Hardstuck. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Hardstuck getting the win they need to take this into another map. You guys wow. just wanted us to cast more, didn't you? <laughs> wow. That was that was really close. That was literally a 63 to a 59 meter dip, like a four meter difference. Indeed. Sometimes, like I said, sometimes these push games, they can actually be pretty good. I think this was an example of a pretty good one. There are other ones that are obviously just not good. But this one was fun to watch. It was super close. Um, and it was really, really back and forth. So I kind of like that one. That was pretty interesting. Okay, wow. we got Busan and Lijong. Can't do Oasis again, so I gotta Busan pick a different one. Busan and Lijong. Lijong. If I can spell Lijong, I cannot. Li, uh, Li I don't know. Jong, and then Clappers get to pick, right? Uh, yeah, Clappers get to pick this map, and it's got to be um, Lijang Tower or um, Busan. We go to map five. Map five. Yeah, they I'm pick Lijong. Haven't, haven't we gone to map five every single feature match? Is that happening? It seems like it, yes. Uh, from what I've read, yes. It's <laughs> crazy. I've, watched, I've only watched one of the feature matches. but I agree yes. with the Laskin Pebble. That was a great beat at the end. The beat was great. Hell yeah. What am I looking for? Legion. Cash for Chaotic. I think we're going to see a Rhine. Oh, maybe Cashavelli's there. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Did I move up? Cash. Move. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, Cashavelli.
Do you think both teams are going to run a Ryan, or do you think Hartstuck's going to run a dive? I think they're going to run the monkey okay. because you have to almost suspect the Symmetra's going to come out here. Very true. Mon Very monkey's true. good against the Sim. I definitely know I'm going to see some Symmetra here. The real question is, yes. are we going to see some dive break? Because it's been long enough. I've waited long enough. It better not be until the playoffs that I start break. seeing the strategy come to fruition. <laughs> Maybe after the rework when she gets her jetpack. Jetpack? <laughs> Wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> I'm, I'm just hoping that she gets a jetpack. <laughs> that would be some next level shit. Imagine if like she gets the jetpack, but she keeps the flail. And she's like, what? <laughs> yes. She'd be like an angel. You have to think about it. She'd be like a warrior angel. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. So this is definitely this map. You normally do see a sim TP strat with a May potentially, maybe even a far Mercy. But I haven't seen Mercy from either of these teams, so I guess we're not going to see a Mercy. Mm -mm. Um, I see Heart a stuck. sim. I'm going to play brawl with no sim. That's interesting. Yeah, I, I, I don't see that very uh, often. I don't know. I think it's in favor of the Clappers in this yeah, team. Yeah, no, on. Clappers just wins this. I'm pretty yeah, sure. I mean, if, if you they get play the turrets... point smart, yeah. Five, Ooh. Four, it's going to be hard for them to take out turrets if you place them right out of Ryan's swing range, entering the choke. Yeah, I think it's going to be really on big time uh, to take the flank and uh, find the turrets as quickly as possible. Oh, the Clappers okay. already fortified on point. Turrets are down. <laughs> Contagious. I saw that. Oh my god. Let's go. Oh my. Oh no. Wait a minute. Well, no, no. They understood they lost. They yeah. understood they had to reset. I don't blame them. That was really smart on Hearthstuck's part. Indeed. I wonder how Hearthstuck's feeling. The Clappers did exactly what we were thought was going to happen. I was just surprised they were stuck in the back way. It's so easy for boobs. I'm very scary. Oh, okay, big, big time, time on the fight. flank here. This is a great flank. Whoops, there we go. Oh, great. That's exactly big what they need. That's the plus space. one. Can they kill the turrets, though? If yeah. they kill these turrets, they win this fight. Like, I, I, I highly believe that. After they're almost going down. Oh, they're really struggling at the choke. Card stuck. Oh, Shoin makes his way in. Oh, the team makes their way in. Just gotta watch for the turrets. Sim, Sim had died in the beginning Oops. there, but found her way back before Ooh. that fight was even over. Jojo and... cleaning up. Jojo yeah. having a field day. Jojo, I see you. I've seen you multiple times throughout the match, but you, this was your strongest, like, play. You didn't even have ult. So good on you. Absolutely. I like a nice high ground push here. Um, from... Okay, I like it. I like it. I like to see it. A little bit of variation. A little bit easier to push out of but you got to make the play it actually has to come out right and here you, you've got your window you have your overclock yep, we got something's window got to come so down general. now got to initiate okay and it, it definitely looks like hard stuck might be pushing out a little bit further than they necessarily need to beat comes out from contagious i don't know if that was was that probably i guess to keep jojo alive they're just going to play point and make them deal with the turrets. This is smart. I mean, the turrets have to be dealt with. I'm just going to say turrets are the best players in the game. Good okay, Cashavelli getting a nice shove push. So no turrets finding kills, but JoJo's going to hurt. The turrets are brutal. Uh, turrets wow. are the best players in the game. Clappers definitely... And Clappers is going to take that. Yeah, that was just having I, the Symmetra, honestly. Yes, you got to take that. Honestly, on this map, it's like you kind of have to take the Sim fight, at least for first fight. So you have a chance to take point, because I feel like whichever Sim sets up on point with their turrets, it's an automatic win for them if they just play point, unless you switch up your comp to make up for the fact that you got turrets. Right, if you swap to, like, Farmer C with Tracer mm -hmm. Ball in Kiriko... For example, even a monkey. I do understand yeah. it's hard. It is. It's very hard though. Once you lose that first fight to a sim, it is very hard to like figure out how you're gonna do it. Five, four, Here I expect to see um, Junkrat come out, but 
I'm not seeing a junk rat actually gotcha. from like. Got it thing. from Hardstuck. And Classy Crew is going to definitely just stay on the Symmetra. They're going to set up the turrets and see if that's going to work again. Although, geometry, a little bit different this time. The turrets aren't quite as auto win as they were last time. And if you look at what you're seeing now, um, Hardstuck has great position. I mean, they've got vantage over the entire point. The whole point's a kill box. So, it's going to be tough for um, Clappers to even like walk on the point in this. But here, Ooh, they I find like a the CP TP. play. Whoa, okay. Actually, wasn't like expecting that. So, they, they come out with a TP player play but weren't able to actually get the focus kill they needed and here um w they're just com completely surrounded by hardstuck hardstuck picking up two kills here making a 5v3 now a 5v2 pretty tough here for for clappers to stay in um point and locks really, in favor really patient hardstuck. really patient yeah it was definitely in favor i think it was really good for clappers to take that initiative to try to get that first kill, but due to them being a hard stuck being a dive team, they just avoided it. And then Schwain was able to jump in and and just kill the people who got separated. But it looks like they're gonna play underneath again, be passive, probably try to score a kill, push point, make Schwain drop. Wow. Let's see if they kill him. They did. They turned around automatically. Oh, they saw that ready. coming. Ready. They reassessed, came back in, and oh Jojo, this is Jojo, you shined and Lijong, you like were shining. Map. You were shining like a diamond this map. <laughs> shining like a diamond. <laughs> okay, they're gonna go mid, hard stuck. Looks like Clapper's gonna, half the team gonna follow behind, the other team gonna meet in the front. Super a little slow to the party, but not late enough where it causes any harm. Hardstuck gonna have to reassess what they're gonna do. Really interesting. Hardstuck they, totally flipping the map fun. here. Oh my gosh, we got two people on the left side. We got two people on the right side. From my perspective. Wait, what is Kirgo? Yeah. Okay. Okay. This is an interesting map. A very interesting approach to the fight here uh, from yes. Hardstuck. Definitely just kind of like doing about Ooh. the weirdest thing I could possibly imagine. Cashavelli connects the shatter to take out Schwain. Okay, Hardstuck's gonna retreat. Maybe this is the point where Clappers is gonna hold the door? No, he's gonna back up. I, I'm i surprised that they're not gonna hold the door. I I am surprised that they're not gonna hold the door because if you deny a Winston the ability to jump yeah. past the door, it's it's huge. You have to make them waste cooldowns to go out the other way. They feel safe but... at the white room, I guess, and I can't blame them. They just surpassed 69 nice percent, so that's really good for them. Yes, Clapper's oh. playing this well. Tiny Donut coming out with the blade. Does he make connect? The beat came out. Okay, Classy doesn't find anyone this time. Join does. Max someone to death. Poor Super. Both teams down to support. Wow. Ooh. Heart stuck down. Heart stuck really needs to like, win this fight. Oh, Heart stuck. Duh. Wow, this is very scrappy, very back and forth, but ooh, clappers. Contagious All right, ninety nine. Are they gonna like kill? Contagious. Finds the roll out he needs. He's getting out of there. Gets away with murder. Doing your job as all Lucio should. Good job. Okay, the staging looks pretty good here. We got a pulse bomb. Wait, pulse bomb comes out. Thing. Okay, <laughs> gets the lamp out immediately. Okay, no lamp for Hardstuck. Okay, let's see what happens. Shoin automatically jumps. Beanie comes out from Bork Bork. Is this enough to secure a kill? No, Classy finds Shoin first. Oh no. Hardstuck is up. Hardstuck is still up. Flappers. Oh, it's their game to lose right now. Ooh. They've got, they're gonna flip the point. It's 99. Oh. Bork Bork didn't hold as long as possible, but I don't think they're gonna hold any longer. That oh. shatter is gonna end the game. Oh my God. Wow, what wow. a reverse. Like, Hardstuck won the first two maps on the first control, and Clappers won the last two maps on this one. Oh wow. my. That was a good game. Great game. I enjoyed watching that. But I do say, uh, Aleska and Pebbles that Chad turrets? Yes. The turrets are very Chad. Turrets are the best players of the game, guys. Turrets I'm gonna say that now. Good. I want to see if any of these players, because last feature match, people want to do post-match interviews. I'm see if any of these players want to come in um, 
for a post-match interview. And little do they know that one does not have a choice. One might not have a choice. So we shall see. Any volunteers? I'm not seeing any people volunteering. And if if absolutely nobody wants to, that's that is also fine. I don't want to like force anything on the people. But um, if you would like to come in for a post match interview, let me know. Um, and if not, then we will wrap some things up here. Me, okay. Jojo. I like Jojo. Let's bring Jojo in here. Okay. Um, I'll go down here. I'll grab me a Jojo. Where is Jojo? Is Jojo's name also Jojo and oh it is right there. Okay. Hello, Jojo. Jojo, I have you pulled in yeah. here. How are you? Yes. What's good? I'm doing good. How are you? Pretty good. Awesome. Um nice, nice, nice. So wow, that was that was such a close game. Like the entire match. It it felt like uh yeah. it was always like it was just like I think wasn't it like a win for, for either one or either team, like alternating every time. So it's like one team won a map, then the other team won a map, then the other team won a map, then the other team won a map. Like it's just back and forth. So like what was going through your head throughout the game? Yeah, it it was fun. It was really fun. It was really fast. A lot yeah. faster than we were used to for sure. So we started off a little rough if you saw the first map. I, I mean, but I, I casted it. Yeah. 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 Of course. <laughs> we yeah. saw the whole thing. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. We eventually picked it up. I thought we did good. It was really fun. It was really enjoyable. Other team did really great. Um, overall, it was a really good match. Really awesome match. Absolutely. You feel, yeah. I feel like you had you had some pop off moments in Li Zhang there. I noticed. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, yeah. you came alive. It's suddenly you're just like a whole other player. It's actually crazy. Oh, yes. You definitely like were the playmaker. Definitely yeah. the playmaker that, of that map. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I did realize that last map, my DPI on my mouse was doubled in accident, so I did have to switch that. Um, so that was unfortunate, but it, it helped out at the end when I switched it back. Yeah. Wow. Well, I mean, awesome job, and uh, yeah. thank you for coming on for your post-match interview. Do you want to do any shout-outs before we, we kick you out of here? <laughs> nothing, uh, nothing specific. Thank you guys for having us. Thanks for casting. It was a fun match. Yeah, it was a fun match, man. Thank you. <laughs> Have a good one. Yep. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Maybe too. Okay. All right. We pull dragging any other people in here, or is this over? We good? Schwain. We got to get Schwain. We got to get Schwain in here. Okay. Let's ask Schwain. Yeah, you're dra sh dragging Schwain. You, are you are you messaging Schwain? Schwain? Are we getting Schwain in here? I choose you, Schwain. Coming in, Schwain. Schwain. Coming in. For post match, we'll see if he wants to come in here for post match interview. Do, 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 do. This is when you need <laughs> that Jeopardy music. True. He said, no. Yep. Or at least Wayne said, yep. You said, yep. So oh, okay. drag him in. His drag manager in. said, yes. Ready or not, here you are. What's up, Schwain? Uh, hello, hello. How's everyone doing today? Oh, doing great. Your voice is amazing. Please say oh, your thing. Yeah. Yeah, that was, <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah, I've had a huge blast, honestly. Uh, what did you guys think? Um, I think this is my... I was gonna say this is my first tournament. Um, we started wow. doing this like in September, starting from last year, uh, just to get really into it. And they put me in take, and I've been playing monkey. So yeah, you've been playing some good monkey. I'll tell you that. That's awesome. So you just started oh, screaming yes. in September. Yes, we started screaming in late September. So that's the twenty sixth, I believe. And then yeah, we've just been hitting it off ever since. So yeah, this is our first tournament. We were very excited, yeah. super pumped for the next match too. But yeah, all yeah. good things. This well, every like map really win match. matters. Every map win matters. So oh, absolutely, because it's a point uh, based system. So that way, we need to have that kind of like positive mentality, regardless of defeat, regardless of draw. Like we yeah. still need to play one hundred percent, one hundred twenty percent every single time, and that's what we tell ourselves. And honestly, I think we did good. Um, we, there's definitely mistakes that we absolutely made, and we're going to review them. I'm super excited to see it because I just love seeing us improve. Like visually yeah. seeing like all these micro trans micro uh, like 
micro plays and macro plays, like the disengaging, knowing when to go in. Uh, it just feels super good just playing with people, especially all of us are friends. So yeah. like we've known each other for years. So I think that's probably one edge that we have against some other people because they may not be familiar with each other and teams. And it'd be like that. That could be a disadvantage that we could capitalize on. I did. I did want to note that I noticed between uh, your gameplay and Slim Jim, I was like noting, I'm like, these these two people are in sync. Like, yeah, they're no. just in sync. I saw it. I saw it. Yeah, Slim Jim, Nathan, um, he, it's mostly him just following me yes. and just knowing when Supporting I want to engage. Yeah, yep, exactly. So he's enabling my dives, essentially. So when he knows I endanger, he suzus basically at the right time. So what it feels like, it just feels so good. I love it. <laughs> I love seeing the follow up too between uh, you, Tiny Donut and Big Time. Like Big Time on the Tracer was great. So much fun to yeah, watch like the entire fight. match like that. I, I scoped it on his perspective like multiple times and it was really, really cool to see. Um, oh, absolutely. You also had some really great pop off moments, some good MTD moments on uh, King's Row there. Definitely a lot to be proud of. There were that play of the game was amazing. Oh, yeah, that's right. Back in uh, King's Row, too. It's like, guys, we may have lost, but I got play of the game. So it's Hell a yeah. win. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I got to keep the head up. Uh, Asman? Yeah. Chat wants to know who do they want to play against? Oh, who do you want to play against next round? Ooh, um, I can't I make see... anything happen, obviously. It's going to be no. Oh, oh, naturally. Like, if we could see in the future, I am very excited to go against Topaz Titans. I've been looking Ooh. at them a little bit. I think they're very impressive. And I've oh, been yeah. seeing, like, they got a different rotation of people. Like, of yeah. course, they still got, um, I think they still got the DPS going, but maybe it's a new tank, maybe new support. Regardless, I think they are very dominant. And it really shows, uh, given their last game. So I'm very excited oh, yeah. to play against them in the future. Wow. So wanting to go against the, the current, like, champions right they won the last oh, tournament absolutely yeah yep, th that's yep. that's some confidence i would love to see that matchup i would love to see you guys stand up to topaz titans that would be super awesome true if it happens next week sweet or maybe we just make it to grand finals i don't know I'll maybe just, whatever <laughs> whatever happens i just want to go against them just so we can improve on ourselves well hit them up maybe they uh maybe they even scream you i don't know oh true all right thank you for the call out i'll yeah. see mm -hmm. if we can notify them all right. Well, thank you so much for the little post-match interview. You've been awesome. Heck and yeah, thank you so much for having me. I hope you have a wonderful evening, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the future. Oh, yeah. I mean, of course, next week. So, yeah. All right. <laughs> I'll see you later. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Good games. Good game. Nice. Okay. Well, um, those are some fun little post-match interviews. We should definitely do that more. That I was, think that so. was pretty cool. I think that was so. wholesome. I love his little story. He had a little little story about his team. He was ready. He was going to share his whole story. <laughs> he had that I want to scrim them now. I want to yeah. scrim them now. I want to scrim them just like 1v5. I'm fine with it. It's fine. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, no. We'll just bring you in as an honorary guest to the I'll ring. I'll, I'll ring. Like, just bring me on. <laughs> okay, okay. We'll we'll put you in for All one right. map. Sounds good. Awesome. Well, anyway... Uh, there's my train that you can probably hear in the background, and I'm sorry I about do, that. I do, I do hear that. It's a fun train. Um, with that, I am going to be turning off the stream, and thank, thank you everyone to my to our 28 viewers here that have come in to support these teams play in this tournament. It's this was a really fun match. Again, not a 4-0. We're seeing some really close matchups here, and that has been some great content. So thank you all for showing up. Thank you all for supporting your teams, and I hope you all have a wonderful Sunday night. Thanks, guys. See ya.